Hello and welcome. In this video, I will show you a full code diagnosis using VESA. Now, we start with the general overview, where if you look closely, there is a search box for fault codes. Here you can enter the fault code that you've retrieved from your scan tool. In this example, I will use P0088. And I will click on search. And here it says the fault code description, which is fuel rail system pressure too high. Now, if you look closely, there's also smart cases, recall data, and technical service bulletins where applicable. I uh, will not go into that now. I will click on the engine management. And that takes me to the VESA dashboard uh, with the fault code diagnosis. Now, here's where VESA becomes really clever because what it does, it takes the fault code and it shows all the diagnostic steps starting with the most probable cause, which in this case is the fuel pressure sensor. So I'll follow that link. And that takes me to the component diagnosis overview with on the left hand side, there's the steps that I have to take. And on the right hand side, there's the uh, specific wiring diagram for this component. Uh, but what I first want to do is go to locations to see where the uh, component is located, which is here, um, see what it looks like. And then I'm ready to start my diagnostic steps, which is the first one is checking the supply voltage on pin number three. Um, now, on the multimeter, that should read anywhere between 4.8 and 5.2. Now, let's for this example say that it reads something else. So I'm going to click no. And that takes me to the next step, which I have to follow. Um, and I follow all the steps until I've done a full, complete uh, component diagnosis. Now, if that's done and no problem has come out, then I can go below the page and to step number two. And then I follow step number two, step number three, step number four, and so on, until I found um, the cause of my problem. And um, that's it. That's why we call it clearly better data.